Correct. So we just we just put a bent uh, box in here uh, for demonstration. Uh, usually, we will, you would like to secure it within a, fix, a fixture or a jig of some sort. But uh, for demonstration purposes, we're just going to line it up as best as we can, and uh, we programmed a, a few geometric shapes to put in on the top of this uh, box okay. for reference. So we're Couple of holes put on the top. Yeah, we'll have a rectangle and a circle uh, and a circle close to the radius of the of the bend of the of the part. So, okay. and that's something you can't normally do. Usually, you cut and then bend, but you can actually come back after a bend if you have something really close. Correct. To the yeah. End, right? yeah. Like I said, you would have probably prob best idea would probably have a, a fixture of some sort to yeah. to uh, hold it securely. But yeah, yeah for demonstration, we'll, we'll run this and okay. show you. And we're gonna walk. Go ahead. So with this, we're going to run our, um, we're going to manually jog okay, the head over. Control for the head? Correct. This is a control for the head. You have your X, Y, Z, uh, and um, B and A are some uh, internal focuses for the uh, for the machine, so we're going to leave B and A alone. But if you, if you've flown drones, you know how to do this. Yeah, basically. <laughs> So, wow, uh, okay, so that's really cool. Just very, uh, very done by hand, but you can. Oh, yeah. Do it. And then there's a little indi laser indicator there. And you can also change your increments of movement. Oh, okay, from so the course to. Right, to fine, correct. Can I see? Let me see if I can see the little edge here. Okay. All right. So we have it set here. We have we we change our thickness uh, the thickness to the height of the part okay. here here in the within the oh, cutting right. condition. Okay. So you would make if you're running something a box of some sort that you're cutting you're processing after yeah. bending. You have to make a separate cutting condition, okay. like uh, like you would copy copy that condition, uh, standard condition, and then input all the all the heights and z's for the for the for the new part. But somehow it also knows the gauge of the metal it's made of. Uh, so that that was that was called out uh, that was called out within our uh, so we, oh, yeah, we yeah, yeah yeah so that was called out. But then you change yeah. your change your thickness, thickness. within within Got the it. cutting condition. Okay. Got it. So. Yeah.